Everyone, it's Rushlock, and this is part three of the Zerg campaign. Moving on this mission here. With the Protoss forces beaten and scattered, the Overmind has withdrawn the swarms to the remote ash world of Char. Alright, so we're going to be facing the Terrans this time. We are to turtle up, protect the Chrysalis, and uh, eliminate the entire Terran presence. Whether or not they'll have a base or be a fixed number of nerds, I have no idea yet, but we'll see soon. Don't worry about that yet. We have Overmines. We're in the bottom corner. Relatively kind size map. This is what we're defending. Spore is anti air, if I remember correctly. We're going to control command these to the two. We'll get this to the three. I'll try and get myself into the habit of associating a, a certain number with a certain unit type. But then moving more drones, more drones. Gas harvesting going soon. It's slow going, but I feel like I'm doing better at remembering which is which for these units. All right, you can mutate. Wait. Creep with the extractor. There we go. I'm gonna say, I see something over here. What the hell is this? A Ragnasar? What the hell's that? Alright, more minerals. Oh, we need more minerals for this thing. Never mind. I tried before, but I had other guys getting made while I did that. Gotcha. We need an Overlord soon. You get gas going as well. I presume with the, the way the mission's formatted, they're going to send waves of Terrans that escalate wave by wave. Right, gas is up and running. When these nerds evolve. We'll send at least one, if not both, over. Likely both. Then we need to focus on getting a certain type of unit made. Crystal seems fine at the moment. We can already make hydralisks. Let's get those started. Hmm, wish I could cancel that. Probably need to make an overmind. There we go. Much better. Now it's just a matter of figuring out how much punch we're going to need to get through the uh, Terran presence. And not overcommitting into leaving no defenses back for a counter punch if they come from a different direction. Still two, still have three. Overmind soon. Very good. I'm pretty sure the Zerg will heal. We didn't lose any nerds. 
That's gonna be another overmind. Let's make me a spire. Me a spire in general. The spire will come from a drone. Guess we'll make another overmind. Overlord, rather. I keep calling them overminds. Right, you require layers. So you're gonna do this. You come down here and make a spire for me. I don't need to keep him idle, but I'll forget about the whole deal if I don't. Perfect mineral usage. I like it. Get more hydralisks up. How many are we at so far? Six. We need six more to make a full group. Send you down here. That's for research. This room was done. There, we need three more. We'll be good to go. There's two of them. Another nerd coming up. Some hostile, though, so. Let's see what happens. The last of the Hydralisk. We still need to make. Oh, do I have this thing going? Yeah, it's mutating. Good. You can make the spire. We require more minerals. And gas. Alright, so you're gonna be a minute. Control two of these, get them grouped up. Alright. Seems fine so far. We'll make a bunch of Zerg for spammage and call it good. Transporting for Overlord. Oh. The sight range. And movement. Wow. I either didn't notice those before or I didn't know that was possible. Let's go there. Get the Zerglings going. I kind of want to leave the mutas back on defense, but a good punch would be really helpful. Maybe I'll take the first batch of Zerglings out for a scouting. I'll take the first one out for a scout. And I'll group the next batch. Our forces are under attack. You there. Who's there in whole position? Oh, we need more drones now. So he killed that one drone. Make three new and put them back on crystals or minerals. We should have... I guess we called him back. Oh, the other one's died. That's awkward. Let's put you up here, then. Put all of... These three over there. Oh, hi there. Well, he's dead. <laughs> he did his scouting job. Full batch of them. They're good. All right. At least we don't know whether or not. So we're going to go up this terrain here, it looks like. Scout some more of that.
I'm gonna go drone out of the next one, get more crystal mineral going. Completion. Get you over there. A new drone somewhere. There he is. So I wanted to build a spire earlier. Looks like we're getting that done now. I'll mutate there. Get more drones for minerals. Make new hydralisks and then we'll roll out. Let's get these guys control ones. Let's go here. We know there's nerds over here. Probably an attempt at expansion. Looks like the vulture ran away. Don't know if it wants us to actually expand on this map. I guess we're going to find out if we could transport the uh, control area. I'm going to come back down this way. I don't see any other way up on this thing. So it should be easily defensible. Seems like a natural choke. Our forces are under attack. But where? Oh. No. But where? There they are. Got him. Zerg there. We're gonna keep an eye out over there while we get these new troops sorted. Let's make new mutalisks. Supply is fine. Should probably make new Zergs for fodder. Resources are fine for the moment. The Zergs just make really good, or Zerglings make really good, uh, fodder to throw out front. I want this one to join the group over here. I think I canceled that one by mistake. Nerds over here. Alright, these nerds control three. This guy is a scout. A matter of finding where they actually are basing out there. Oh! Oh, the tank caught him. Okay, never mind. That's not good. Our forces are under attack. All right, we're hold them there. We need to find a way over there that doesn't involve flying of those things. Um, let's go here. Zerg it up. We'll send Zerg up there, or Zerglings up there, and then, uh... Wants to see. I wish there were a way... I guess we'd fly around this, but it wouldn't really help us. Long term. 
I'm gonna see if we can sneak through here without getting tanked. I'm doubting that we can. Oh, hi there. Alright, so if we carefully travel over there, we might be able to get scoot past this tank. Make sure there's nothing base wise over here anywhere. Pretty sure. Oh, nope. Yeah. Okay. Regroup here. We want to take that position. Resupply. Control one those. Send them to join this one. Let's get some new mutalisks. And rejoin this one as well. I don't know if it will auto path and join that group or if it'll try to get tanked. Because we're going to find out. The flyers will be easy. We can just send them straight there. Supplies are still fine. We still have an expansion option. Butchered. Have them hold position. I don't know if that one ever made it around, or if it got intercepted, or what happened to it. Control to them to confirm. Control three of these nerds. Put them there. Get the next batch ready. Now that attack came down while I was wanting to punch into this area over here. But we do know they have uh, a base over here as well, but we don't know how we're going to get up there yet. I'm guessing there's going to be a ramp there. I'll take one nerd to scout it. Oh, I see the, uh, the thing over there. Be careful on that one. Two sides of it. That's no good. But, we did find a place where we can march up. We can put uh, ground forces up this middle, and they'll be fine. Put them there. You. More hydralisks. Those were heavily depleted. Let's see if we can get the zerglings over here. The tank around this corner was the main thing. Yeah, they're getting lapped. Our forces are under attack. Didn't follow us though. Control one of those. Have them hold. Have them group up. So, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 at least there. There's 11. Over mines are still fined. Or. The Lords, I would say that. At the last the Hydralisk we need for a full block of 12. Until that tank is clear, I don't think we can really push much of the zergling through that side. We're going to have to carefully navigate up this 
and try to get into this area. Two ramps. I'm sure there'll be tanks over there. There's a bunker, in fact. There's probably a bunker there as well. I should say likely. I don't know if probably was there or not. Um... Want more mutilisks then? We're gonna end up fighting that uh, vulture, I presume. I need to find the buildings that have the research options. There's the spire. Fly or attack. Not about Zergly movement anymore. Attack range. And the gas harvesting has been super slow. I guess I've been burning it on the mutas, maybe. And probably the hydras. We can't go all flyer because of the. Uh... Where the hell are they going? Our forces are under attack. Uh oh. They're, they're fucked. I never grouped them with the proper group. Did I lose all my mutas? Or my... Yeah. All Hydrolyxes are dead now. Except the new batch that for some reason can't pad. Get there. Get all nerds back here. They make it back great if not. Oh well. Never assigned them a number. That was terrible. Make him the new anchor. A couple of zerglings made it back. Let them be bullet catchers. Alright. Time to reform the army. Into the gas. Zerglings are just not going to punch up that middle. We got more vision though. The bunker can shoot at flyers. Because I need to knock out these defenses and then we get in there and we're, we're going to do great. It's going to take way more gas to make that happen. Gas remain 2k. We have a right number of workers on it. We just burned a lot of gas on the units we've been making. Which means I'm not making enough zerglings to uh, soak. Let's see if we can address that. I guess the hunters last time soaked a good bit for me. That, we actually didn't use them at all, though. We'd already found the objective and pathing before we ever got control. Right, research somewhere is happy. Don't care about zergling movement at the moment. We care about attack, though. Attack range would be nice as well. But we need way more gas for that. Right, control one those. Have them join over here. Two makes that ten. Eleven, twelve. We're gonna have a few too many, but it'll be fine. We're not in any kind of supply limitation issue. We need gas to rebuild. Control one. So bring them up this way. We have these guys at control three. Control two. 
Okay, five, eight, and twelve. I need more hydras, more mutas. But with the resources we have, the hydralisks are more likely to happen at the moment. That'll give me eleven. The meters we have will just have to be enough because we're not going to make enough gas to be relevant. I can make one more uh, Hydra though before we roll out. Their move speed is terrible. Let's see if we can address that. Especially before they go in. I don't need them slow booting around. I'm trying to get in range to apply their damage. Put some over as well. Three is still good. Research is still happening on this one. I wonder if a drone can. Into a hatchery, I'm guessing. Before it becomes a layer. Okay. Regroup those. You. Into a hatchery. Get the next base going. More creep. More progress, hopefully. Evolution complete. Still have twelve of those. I'm gonna need more hydras. Three more there. Three more after that would be ideal. Can't remember if this gives control or not. I'm gonna find out. I guess I can check this one. Provided only one. Okay. It's fine. We can still build off of this and expand. We have enough minerals to build the next gas thing. Let's bring them over here. Get one more after that. I'm guessing we should have expanded into this as soon as we discovered it and realized the lay of the land and how we were going to get choked here a little bit. If I take enough flowers over at one time, I can punch through all this stuff and not have to worry about it anymore. But we're going to need the resources before we can even consider that. And then we still have to deal with these missile batteries everywhere. I'd have to be able to blap them much more quickly. A drone going at least. Go from there. When they deplete resources, we can move them over. Extractor over here. More creep. Build very quickly. Uh, we can afford this, might as well do it. Get nerds moving. This will be all three of these. Well, there's gonna be one more. Yeah, good. One, two, three. Three for gas. Finish the crystals soon. Alright. Can I use this to make the troops too? I guess within the larva it becomes an issue, so. Let's get our troops selected. Yeah. 
one is this one. That's not good. That should be control one. Control two of those. There we go. We have the gas now to get more of the mutalisks going. We're going to overmine soon. Overlord. Oh, I'm never going to stop calling them overmines. Any more drones? Any more of these guys coming over? Let's do that. Oh wow, another gas? No, okay, I thought that was. Thought we were rich. 4k there. Get these guys over this way. Let's get them all up. I'd really like another batch of them. The river line is good to go. Any more research I wanted to do? Guess that. Attack range, yes. Let's get all the evolution going. Now all these nerds. Go there. Alright. Perfect timing to expand to our second base. These guys will start making new units. I'm getting the idea, there we go. Control 2 that. Control 3 that. Got another batch coming. Still get a couple more at least. I'd rather counterpunch them instead of diving into their whatever army they've been building up for their next attack, but short of getting like a huge wave of flyers, I just don't know how we're gonna do that. As it is, the flyers have to go over here, the the, the uh not the mutas. The hydralisks have to come like sneaking through. The Zerglings just die immediately when they do it. These grouped up and then we'll be good to go. Control three of them. I guess is fine. Alright. So the towers are getting me. And, and just whelping this much gas all at one time is crazy. But we'll see what we can do. The tank is gone. That was a little helpful. Stay away from there. Take out their ability to fight back. Stay up the side with the supply going down. Nice. This will draw whatever military they have. These guys are really good against everything except. Me. They did really well against the tanks' slow rate of fire, but those marines were less than good for us. Let's go there and build some new ones. Oh, they're fine. You build mutas. Go. Progress. Slow. But progress. Ugh, wish we had transports. At least now I know I can punch up this side if I need to. Beforehand, it was a lot more... dicey. We didn't have all of our upgrades yet, either. Hydro movement will help. Flyer armor, I like it. All the resources. Gas hasn't depleted yet. Still have a good batch of crystals to work with. Oh, 
pieces. I want the attack. It goes over there. Good. Oh shit, bring them back. We're fine. Easy. Control three of them. Keep them together. Alright, one, two, one, two. Put you there. Put you there. All forces are under attack complete. More rescue needed. Bring them back down. You. More mutas. Let's move back up. You're a real drone. Put you back in crystals, I guess. I could put like a, um, a creep colony, the anti-air one. I feel like we're gonna punch into them hard enough that's not gonna matter. Control three. I do need more hydralisks though. I'm only eight, even after these two. I guess I can grab some here. And send them up afterward. You know, they're overmined soon. Oh, wrong guy. I need a larva out of this one. Would be ideal for the overmind. There we go. Overlord. Perfect. Get down here with these guys. Get in there. Alright, there should be a good flying force this time. Nice and grouped up, I like it. That's gonna be a Hydra, right? That's six, eight, ten. I have two more being built. You are finished. We're good on control. I think we're good. Maybe I'll bring the Zerglings last and let them just run amok in the backfield causing chaos and then let my main units focus fire. Otherwise I'll just run them in the front I guess and let them soak. Let the research complete, I like it. Perfect. Control to these, we'll have these guys ready. I want to see what I can get for the mutas this time. They're really good at punching in. So when they find marines with the issue, it starts being terrible. Right, they ate that one. Just gotta make sure I don't walk into a bunch of marines at once. Bring them back. Too many Marines. Let's get them over here. I don't want to go in all at once and eat all these flak towers or anti air towers. So maybe I'll go soften them up first after I get my next wave built up. I'll put me at 11. Should be trying to counterpunch soon as well. Alright. Take them out and see what we can find. Got all the marines grouped up. Tank can't fire back.
Oop, come back. Got two airborne coming in. That part's fine. We can see if we can bait those marines back to the other side. While we do that, get more mutas up. Nope, nope, definitely did not pull that off. No, no, no. Okay. Marines are grouped, though. Control three of those. We got a full group again. Perfect. Excellent timing. I think we have the placements up and running as well. All right. So we can at least approach this side without too much concern. Perfect. Zerglings getting in there. Cover firing everything. Did he just nuke my entire basilisk group? I think every Basilisk died in one shot to those tanks. Let's regroup these guys. Let's make sure they don't get through here. Control 3, alright. I think the Hydralisk got completely nuked off the map by the tanks. I don't think we blapped any, but we did take all of the control towers over here. But I have no idea what we're going to do against all those damn Marines. Other than establish a, uh, a position on this side and push in first, make them come to us. Control two of those, put them over here. Need more of something on this side as well. Three, fuck, I only need one more of these. Hydra's up and running. Man, those Hydra's got absolutely nuked. I think like two shots from a tank. That could have been multiple tanks for all I know. We can't at least see the control center now. And there's no anti-air in between us and them. It's just a bunch of Marines we gotta deal with. I think the mutas are gonna carry them now. Like, we're almost out of crystal or minerals to harvest. We still have gas coming in though. Hmm. Put you over there. Oh, I had two down here, didn't I? Nope, three. That's eleven. I have an extra one there. All I can think is two pronged attack, but like the the hydralisk won't live long enough to bait things over. But if I can get up and around this side, we can avoid that stuff entirely and just go for the command center. And then it's just clean up duty after that. I'm just so low on resources. I wonder if I'm supposed to expand it on this side somewhere. Control three that. Right. Control two that one. Hydralisk gotta stay on defense. I can't think of any other way to pull it off. I need these nerds to do the job. There be so many damn marines though. So many Marines. Just so many. We get them to that. Still has us at seven. I don't think the Hydralisk can shoot over the up the wall to be relevant. That I'm aware of. Like that I could bait them over, but Six are being built. We have seven. 
and get more hydras going. I mean, zerglings were actually way more effective than I gave them credit for getting in there, so maybe the front door is back to being the A plan. Taking out that barracks would be amazing. We'd have to get to it. That's gonna be the trick. The barrack, uh, the bunker went down on this side. Maybe this is still possible. Control three of this. In there, you, Hydras. All forces are under attack. Let's get this hit and run go. See if we can get this guy over here. Track this guy down. Nope. Please fall back. Good, good, good. All right. The Hydralisks are. Carrying their weight now. They're trying to punch out now. This one by himself. There. I hear the shooting. There it is. Okay. We don't care about the drones so much now because there's not much for them to gather. Control three of them still. Good to go. Get them over there. Control two. I'm going to need way more hydralisks. Two. One geyser is depleted. So I'm guessing both geysers are now depleted. Okay. Minerals are doing what they can. You. Now here. Don't fight this thing. I know the bunker can shoot the uh, mutas, but let's see what we can scout over here and see if we can find anything to our advantage. Doesn't mean they're not here, but we didn't see any, um... Oh, good, another expansion opportunity. So if there were Marines here, they're long gone. Not sending any marines over here yet. There they are. Spoke too soon. All right. Can we kite them back? If we can kite them. This would be pretty good. Kite them back to our uh, basilisks. We didn't need to there. We may have gotten into a situation where they've expended all their resources. I'll see in a moment. Nope, definitely not. Okay. It's the SCV right there. I only want him to keep following. Let's see if he has troops stretched out. Let's see if we can just break them here. Okay. SCV was trying to prepare it. This will get rid of the air units, at least.
This is a barrack. Stay with that stupid building. Oh, we can block that pretty quickly. Alright, I think we're just cleaning up now. Repairing? Still gathering. Let's go there and hold position. Next we can clear the map and we're good to go. So I think in hindsight, I could have, could have, would have, should have, just made two groups of mutas and just punched everything. We don't need to kill every building. I don't think. I think we just need to take out their capacity to making. Any kind of units or war. So fly around, see if we find any units chilling somewhere. They won't be south because then they would have to run into our hydras. At least I hope it doesn't destroy every building. Here we go. I guess we'll just herd them up. Isn't there a barracks? It's not barracks, okay. Engineering bay. So that tank going over that way. Is that it? Anybody else? Pretty sure Engineering Bay is just technology. I don't think they actually have any units. I don't know where else their units could be. Guess we'll have to look. No way it's destroying supply matters. Academy's research. There's gonna be a unit somewhere hiding out. But where? We maybe chase them to the low grounds, but not quite to our base. We're still gathering minerals over there. We still protect the chrysalis. We'll check the objective. Protect it and eliminate the Terran presence. Okay. Maybe it is as simple as uh, 
destroy all buildings, or if not, maybe destroying the buildings will lead us to the unit we can't find. I think one of the buildings burned down while we left. It wasn't even all buildings, it was like a like a ratio or something. Cerebrates, you must stay and relocate the chrysalis to a more secure location. Dagoth shall deal with the remaining Terran forces. There we go. Another successful mission. We'll see you back soon with mission number four.